For more videos, visit forthesakeofeducation.com. All right, guys, we're going to do these uh, three problems where you have uh, determined the magnitude of the moment of the force and you're given the Cartesian vector uh, form of the force. They want you about AB, about BC, and about CA. So, let's do this part first. Open a new layer. All right, so you know that the moment about AB is given by U, AB, AD cross F. So the first thing you need to find is UAB, which is a univector with a magnitude of one right here. So you know that UAB is given by the vector AB divided by its magnitude. So if A sits at 0 on the i plus 2 on the j plus 0 on the k and B sits at 3.5 in the i plus 2.5 in the j plus 0 on the k AB which is B minus A is equal to 3.5 i plus 0.5 j plus 0 k. The magnitude of AB is found by doing the x component square plus the y component square plus the c component square. Once you plug in these three values into this formula, you get that the magnitude is equal to 3.54. And then the univector is found by dividing these three values by this magnitude and you get that the univector is equal to 0 0.9899 in the i plus 0 0.1414 in the j plus 0 in the k. So we have the first vector. Vector AD we know that D sits at 2.5 in the i plus 2 in the j plus 4 in the k. So AD is D minus A and AD is equal to 2.5 in the i plus 0 in the j plus 4 in the k. So now we got AD and we are given the force at the beginning of the exercise so we're good to go. Moment created by AV is equal to on the first one, we got to put the univector AV, 0.9899. On the second one, we put 0.1414. On the last one, we put 0. On the second row, we want to put AD, which, which, which is found, which is 2.5, 0, and 4. And on the last one, we put the force, which is 50, minus 20, minus 80. You do your, sorry, you got to rewrite your first and second column, 0 0.9899, 0.1414, 2.5, 0.50, minus 20. You do your positive diagonals. First positive diagonal is 0. Second positive diagonal, 0 0.1414 times 4 times 50 is equal to 28.28. .28. The third one is zero, and now you do your negative diagonals. The first one is zero, the second one is negative, negative 20 times 4 times 0 0.9899, it's equal to positive 79.2. Last one's negative, negative 80 times 2.5 times 0.1414, and it's also positive 28.28. .28. So when you add all this up, it comes out to be about 136. The force is in newtons and the distances are in meters, therefore newton meters. So that's the first one. Now we're going to go to the second one. Now the second one we got the moment about BC that's given by univector BC 
distance from C to D cross F. So UBC is equal to the vector BC over the magnitude of BC. BC is given by C minus B. Uh, we already found B. I'm just going to find C now. C sits right at 2i plus 0j plus 0k. And B we already had, we just found it before. So C minus B comes out to be minus 1.5 in the I, minus 2.5 in the J, plus 0 in the K. The magnitude of BC is found by doing the X component square plus the Y component square plus the C component square. You plug in these three values into this formula and you get that the magnitude of BC is 2.92. Then when you divide these three values by its magnitude, you get the univector BC, which comes out to be negative 0.514 in the I, minus 0.857 in the J, plus C on the K. So we got the first vector, now we need CD is equal to D minus C, and it comes out to be 0.5, in the i plus 2 in the j plus 4 in the k. Now we have CD and we got the force which is given. So the moment about BC is equal to we build our matrix. On the first one, we're going to put the univector BC, which is 0.514 negative, don't forget the sign, minus 0.857 and 0. The second one goes for CD, 0.5. 2, 4. Last one goes for F, which is 50, minus 20, minus 80. So we rewrite the first and second column. 0 0.5, 2, 50, minus 20. Not a lot of zeros, so this one's a bit of a pain. Positive diagonals negative 0.514 times 2 times negative 80 is positive 82.24 negative 0.857 times 4 times 50 is equal to minus 171.4 0 negative diagonals 50 times 2 times 0 0 uh, negative negative 20 times 4 times point negative 0.514 is equal to minus 41.12 and the last one is negative negative 80 times 0.5 times negative 0.857 is minus 34.3 and when you add all this up you get that this is equal to negative 165 again meters force is in newtons therefore it is newton meters but it's a magnitude so it's 165 newton meters magnitudes are positive so, find the answer for the second one. Now we're going to do the third one. MCA is given by the univector CA times AD cross F. So, UCA is given by CA over the magnitude of CA. CA is given by A minus C. A minus C is equal to minus 2 in the I plus 2 in the J plus 0 in the K. Magnitude of CA is equal to the square root of the X component square plus the Y component square plus the C component square, which comes out to be 2.83. So when you divide this three, um, this three, uh, this Cartesian vector by this magnitude, you get that the univector is equal to negative 0.707 in the i plus 0.707 in the j plus 0 in the k. And now we have our univector. We find a d by doing d minus a. d minus a. So d minus a comes out to be 2.5 
in the i plus 0 in the j plus 4 in the k we got ad and we got f because it's given so let's build our matrix on the first one goes uca which is negative 0 0.707 0 0.707 and 0 on the second row goes ad which is 2.5 0 and 4 last one goes for the force which is 50 minus 20 and minus 80 you rewrite the first and second 2.5 0 50 minus 20 positive 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 diagonals First one zero, second one point seven oh seven times four times fifty, I believe is one forty one point four. Third one zero. Negative, negative, negative. First one zero. Second one is negative. Negative twenty times four times negative point seven oh seven is negative I believe fifty six point six. And the last one negative negative eighty times one point five times point seven oh seven is positive one forty one point four which comes out to be 226 again newton meters because forces in newtons distances are in meters final answer for the last one please comment below if you want me to do any problems and i'll be happy to help thank you